Are we? I think we are. We are here. We've got a bunch of people in chat today. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Shout out to Random Pleats, Frozen Samurai, Demo, Falco Lambda, Wah, Perunatox, Yuri Adopted, good to see you, man. Uh, Infernape. Anyone else who is out there, hello. I am very hyped to be playing this game. I'm very hyped. I love me, uh, Final Fantasy. But uh, I will. I will shock the world right now by saying I have never played the original Final Fantasy VII. Or, actually no, let me rephrase that. I have not played past disc one of the original Final Fantasy VII. I tried playing it on an emulator back when I lived in Gibraltar, so that really dates this. And I remember getting out of Midgar, and I played a bit of it, but I just couldn't stick with it. So... I know that this specific Final Fantasy VII Remake, it basically is just everything within Midgar. So it's not the full story, it is just like the first part of a bigger story that is going to be told with multiple games. But I pretty much know the plot of the Midgar section of Final Fantasy VII, and I did watch bits of a playthrough from Super Butter Buns when this game first came out. So I do know quite a bit about the game, actually. Not in terms of gameplay. I, I didn't pay attention to the gameplay. I was all about the story. But um, I am excited because I want to experience it myself. I want to have that experience. It's been like seven months. I barely remember anything. So I'm hyped. Um, I hope you guys are all having a wonderful evening today. How dare you not play this absolute classic? I may have done the same thing, but shush. I know, I'm such I'm, I'm such a tool. Oh my god. Uh, before we do get started, though, I want to do my quick, you know, little spiel at the start of each stream. Uh, we do have a donation goal up above us to afford Pikmin 3. It's a 60 euro donation goal, and if we can hit that, I will be able to purchase Pikmin 3, and we'll be able to play that on stream at some point, because I would like to. Uh, that being said, please do not feel pressured to donate. I just want you guys to enjoy the stream. Uh, aside from that, if you have any friends who might be interested in watching me play Final Fantasy VII Remake, please let them know. I will be playing this today. Uh, I'll be playing it on Sunday as well. Tomorrow is going to be Dead by Daylight, so we're going to try and do multiple games each week. It's going to be a lot of fun. But most importantly, uh, I have a new Discord. I have a Discord dedicated to the Twitch channel, specifically just the Twitch channel, nothing to do with YouTube, just the Twitch. Uh, and you can... Uh, if you want to join, uh, you get updates every time I stream, and if you're a Twitch subscriber, you get access to a little Twitch room, and it's just a little small Discord, nothing crazy, nothing big, nothing major, just a little place, just kind of chill, and I'll probably be, uh, active there, uh, most days. So, yeah, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be fun, this is gonna be fun, this is gonna be fun, I'm excited. So, I've already gone through the options and kind of just sorted myself out a little bit. Kind of just, you know, had a bit of fun there. So, I'm going to do the quick introduction for YouTube. Well, no, 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 you know what? No, fuck it. No, I'm not going to do the introduction for YouTube. YouTube, if you're watching, hello. Um, we're just going to get started. Because I know there's a big intro cutscene. So, uh, I'm going to go default. I don't know where all of, like, the, the HUD is going to be for this game. So, there's a very good chance I might accidentally be, like, covering stuff on the HUD. We'll see. Uh, classic. The player-controlled character will attack and defend automatically. No. Uh, we're doing normal. Because we can't do hard. So we're gonna do normal. There we go. Alright. And we get this beautiful opening cutscene. There is a hard mode, I just can't do it right now. I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. There we go. There's not a lot of audio going on right now, though, so don't worry if you can't hear much. This looks so good. I will say, this this game is beautiful. This game is genuinely beautiful. And this was the shot they used, I think, back um, when this was announced originally at E3. They kind of used shots like this to hype up the game. And of course, uh, Tetsuya Nomura... Uh, the Kingdom Hearts dude, very much into this. God, I, I love this look at Midgar here, because Midgar looks more like a city here. 
Whereas in the original game, it didn't feel like an actual city that you would live in. It felt more like just a steampunk industrial wonderland. But this is like a full on city. Like you could imagine this as an actual place. Doggo! Oh, cute doggo. Join the Discord literally right before you start the streaming time that pretty well. Oh, that was you. Okay. That makes sense. The hider. Yeah. Got it. Can't believe they got the guy from Kingdom Hearts on the Game Boy Advance his own game. Oh, look at all the children. Look at those eye graphics. Look at the detail of that eye, you know? Now, obviously, this is like the opening cinematics and stuff, but it blends seamlessly into the gameplay, as you will see. It's very movie, you know? <gasps> oh, we're gonna go see Aerith now. We're gonna go see Queen. One of my favorite things about this game was watching the voice actress for Aerith play through the game and, like, cry. when She, she, she broke down into tears when she saw her character for the first time. Look how beautiful she is. Look at this beautiful woman. Look at this icon. Look at this legend. Look at this. We stan. Hey, Naz. Welcome, man. Oh, I fucking love her. She's so cool. Just in the back streets. Oh, so beautiful. Theme song sung by Yosh. I didn't realize that there were lyrics in the theme song. Oh wait, no, I can hear them. Also, fuck that guy who just knocked Aerith. Wow, fuck you. Fuck you, mate. Fuck you. You fuck with Aerith, you fuck with everyone. There's more polygons and a freckle in her face than the entirety of Minecraft. That is true. That is actually true, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, fuck that dude in particular. That one specifically. Fuck him. Ah, oh, beautiful. This game looks insane. God damn. Like, at night, it feels a lot more steampunk than in day. Like, in the day, you can kind of see the city. At night, it just... It looks like something out of Blade Runner. Woo! Da-da-da, da-da, da-da. Oh, here he comes. Alright, it's time to go commit some terrorism, everybody. There he is! There is our boy! There is Big Emo Boy with Big Emo Sword. With Big Emo Backstory. Mako Reactor 1. Look at these guards with their polygons and their faces. <laughs> ah, shit. We've, we've already gone and fucking killed his fucking friend. Goodbye. Easy. Easy. Oh no, trust me, I, I know about Cloud's character. I know about his character, I know about his past. I know about that. I've I've I know everything about Cloud, trust me. I know like the big the big thing, I know all of that. I'm just not gonna i I'm not gonna say it for anyone who's never seen uh Final Fantasy VII before, but I know Cloud's character. Oh look at him, so beautiful. And we're straight into the gameplay. There we go. He really just does look this good. Alright, let me see. So we can slash with square. Cool. Uh, I can pause and it does nothing. And we have cutscenes. Who goes there? Oh, was that Matthew Mercer? I'm pretty sure that was Matt Mercer voicing that guard there. Okay, use square to attack with Cloud's sword. Hold square to unleash an attack capable of hitting multiple nearby enemies. I do not know the controls of this game, so this is good. I like this. You're coming um, with us. Nice and easy. Don't think so. I'm pretty sure that's Matt Mercer. Damn, we just fucking leveled up straight away. God damn, we just fucking destroyed him. 
dead. Absolutely dead. Seamless gameplay transition from Final Fantasy VII Remake right there. Hands where I can see them. Go on, go on. Go on, terrorists. Have fun. Fucking love Jesse. I love Jesse so much in this game. Like, these characters are all very bit characters in the original, but here they are so fleshed out. Uh, the ATB gauge fills as time passes and by attacking with square. Once a bar is full, your character can perform special actions. Charges can be used immediately or saved. Try attacking the enemy to fill the gauge. Okay. Move and we shoot. Go ahead. Ooh, you can expend ATB gauge charges to use battle commands, such as using abilities, magic, or items. Okay. Yeah, and you kind of get like this frozen moment. Um, I'm gonna use fire. Fuck it, let's burn him. Boom. Barrett just has a hand for a gun, a literal handgun, yes. He is a walking pun. Uh, when not in battle, you can check the map, open menus, and view various kinds of information. Okay, cool. Um, um, when that icon appears, you can jump over items. Cool. A lot of little tutorials here. Just want to take a little look. All right. And then from the menu, we can see battle settings, uh, enemy intel, spells. We have fire, PK fire. Uh, we have potions. And it's just us, a large broadsword that has inherited the hopes of those who fight. Woo oh, yeah, that's saying something. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, more guards? Drop the weapon. No. You got this. Yeah, what he said. <laughs> All right, come on then. All right, guarding and evading. You can defend against enemy attacks by pressing R1 to guard or circle to evade. You're okay. With us. Can't get surrounded. Uh, that's not what I wanted to nope. do. Oh, look at that. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Let's just burn him. Burn. Oh, he even just goes burn as well. Oh my God, Cloud, please. You're too edgy. You're too edgy for me, my man. Nice. Can I pick this up? Was that was that something that was able to be picked up? I don't know. I don't know if that sword info is backstory related, but that is anime as fuck. Let's just say yes. Uh, that sword has a lot of backstory. Ooh, and it's very painful. Um, interacting with the world. You can press triangle to open chests or doors or talk to people. If you see the word hold, then you need to hold down rather than press it. Okay. Oh, I wish I wish it was like I think Kingdom Hearts where you kind of kick uh, chests open. I can't remember if it's Kingdom Hearts where you kick chests open, but I know there's a game I like that you can uh, kick chests open in. It's very quick. All right, where is everybody? Oh, if you find boxes with the Shinra logo, press square to smash them with your sword. Okay, that's cool. I'll do that. Oh, I broke. I broke them. I obtained a potion. There are some boxes over here we can break too. I love breaking me some boxes. And we can run as well. Breath of the Wild, that's what I'm thinking of. Okay, yeah, mm-hmm. So what's Soldier Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? Yes. He's got balls, this, uh... Cloud. Uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional. Unlike the rest yeah, of we're us. a professional. We know what we're doing. <laughs> I love him. This is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Damn. Uh, oh, you, 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 you've hurt the, you've hurt the lovable dog. Now he's upset, Cloud. Look how sad he is, Cloud. Yeah, and you get nice kind of dialogue from these guys as well as they're talking. I like that you can kind of like listen, listen to them as they're talking. All right, let's go chat with Barrett. The game wants us to chat with Barrett. Uh, Jesse's voice is like 100% Errol Lindbeck. I swear to God, I don't remember who she is voiced by, but I know she's familiar. Wedge is precious. We stand. We stand. Wedge. Eleven viewers. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. <laughs> what? Yeah, shutting you down. I'm sorry, Wedge. 
Cloud is a very tough nut to crack. If you want to go down the Cloud romance route, Wedge, you're going to need to do better than that. Wedge. Uh. Oh, bless him. Fucking love Barrett, man. He's such a good character. You be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. And his voice actor in this game is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I mean, all the voice actors in this game, honestly, are quite fantastic. Barrett is heavy weapons guy, but he's also like... He's got so much character to him as well. And you kind of learn more about his character. It's like, aww. The good man. Uh, you can press R3 to lock onto specific target. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Uh, boy. Oh shit, what? Oh my god, there's dogs. Alright, I am going to not use anything, because apparently I can't. But I can now. Let's burn the doggo. It's a guard dog, so it needs to burn, you know? It's just a rule. Oh, I don't know what staggered means. I don't know what that means. What does Punisher mode mean? Oh, we can go into our strong attack. Okay. All right. Cool. I love that. I don't think the game explained that, but I love that. I don't think we can break. No. All right. Hello? God, they're all way further ahead. Jesus, wait up for me. Come on. Well, how about you just wait for me and we won't have to fucking worry? Okay? It's as simple as that. Uh, I like fire like any other pyro, but Billy, did you just say burn the doggos? The fuck? These are bad doggos. I'm sorry. They're doggos that are gonna, like, chew your face off. Those are not the kind of doggos that I'm okay with. If an enemy is staggered, you can deal bonus damage. Okay. Makes sense. They're still doggos. Well, I'm sorry, but if the doggo's gonna, like, murder me, I'm not gonna be like, okay, you can murder me. That's fine. This way. Oh, through we go. How do I crouch? Huh. Not so fast. We've got company. Okay, we're not crouching. We're just getting fucked over. Okay, cool. Oh, that's another doggo. See, that is a very angry doggo. I'm sorry. Like, it doesn't even have eyes. Uh, okay. I have no idea what I just did. No idea what I just did. You know what's happening is, like, I'm pressing, um, the X button thinking, oh, it's gonna do something like, um, like, it's gonna do something, and then I get frustrated, like, because I, I, for some reason I'm like, oh, maybe it's, like, it will make you jump, or it will make you dodge from, like, other games, you know? But then it opens up the menu, so I'm like, oh, well then, I need to be a little bit more careful, and I need to get used to this game's control scheme, that's all. Uh, how do we, how do we crouch? Pretty sure you're spamming. I am spamming, yes. Hello? <laughs> Give me items. I want items. I want the good shit, please. Do you have the good shit? I also like you can see the materia in the uh, in the items here. I think that's so cool. Uh, I'm gonna use Braver. I want to see what this does. I'm curious. Oh, that's what that was. Okay, so there, there are special attacks. Nice. I like that we do have, indeed, special attacks that do special things. There we go. I'll be fine. It's the start of the game. I'm not supposed to know how to play it. Not yet. I'm not on hard mode, so... Oh, finally, the way... Oh, okay. All right, what are you doing, Wedge? You, you're just chilling? Okay, cool. Well, good luck. Good luck, Wedge. All right, into Mako Reactor 1. Gonna get that moolah. By winning. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs, too. Oh, fuck off, Barrett. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? I like Barrett, but he has Ain't such an attitude with Cloud at the start, I swear. Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? 
Or is he a loyal little doggy? Oh. Have it your way, Mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. He's just different so reactor, different layout. Depends emotional. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. I do like that Barrett is like the sort of person who can fire you up. He is like someone like if, if he was running for president, you would vote for him. You would. He would just inspire you insanely. I'm watching you. Okay, cool. I'm watching you too. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. In three, two. Damn, I'm good. Damn, he's good. Who's there? If he doesn't turn into a potato wedge at some point in the game, I'm gonna riot. Oof. Oh, wait. Ah, shit. Well. It's over. Yeah, no. That's my line. Oh my god, he's such a dork. That's my line. Cloud. Each character has a unique ability you can activate with Triangle. With Cloud's mode shift ability, you can switch between his balanced operator mode and his attack oriented punisher mode. Okay, so that's what this was. Cool. In Punisher mode, Clouds move more slowly, but Square unleashes a more powerful attack. In addition, Cloud launches a counter blow every time he guards against an enemy's melee attack. He cannot, however, guard against ranged attacks or magic. When you evade such attacks, you'll switch back to operator mode. Okay. Ooh! Cloud, calm down. So aggressive. Ooh. Let's move. Oh yeah, Barrett's been around. He's a very popular character. One hundred percent, you'll have seen him in some like new ground shit. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. I know that voice Anyone actress. Else command will talk to us, but what can you do? Then we're good. I'm trying to figure out, like, what game she's from there. that I have played. Because I think it is Erica Lindbeck, but I don't remember what um, role she one. does. God, all the girls in this game are really cool. I just want to say that. Like, I may be gay, but the girls in this game very much would challenge that if I wasn't so confident in my, my masculinity. Security is only going to get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. I know her from something else. I f uh, does she voice any other Fire Emblem characters? Looks like the elevator's on another floor. I know that character. Mind I'm... pushing that button? No, fuck it. I'm sorry. I'm 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 going. I need to fucking look this up. Erica Lindbeck. Sorry. I'm 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 going to take a look at her. I'm sorry, guys. I need to just see. I need to just remind myself. Let me just make sure that she definitely is. Uh. Yeah, she's Jessie. Okay. Oh, that's where she is. Fucking, she's Futaba from Persona Five. She's 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 Futaba. She's she's um hacker girl. Of course she is. That's exactly where I've heard her from. That's exactly where I know her from. Of course she is. Mind pushing that button? There we go. Suddenly everything makes sense now. <laughs> so you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but. Are you guys close? Mm -hmm. The inkling looking one, yes. The gamer. Are you and Tifa close? Oh, we're we getting. Are we really getting this already? This is Cloud's home. I can't remember the name of the town, but this is where Cloud and Tifa grew up. Cloud! Are you ignoring me? Hey, Jack. Playing an eco-terrorist on November 5th. Oh my god. Too oh right, because bonfire night, of course. I completely forgot about bonfire night. Shit. Well, down we go. Cloud just like... Yeah, Guy Fawkes isn't eco-terrorist, he's just a normal terrorist. Ooh, that skybox. Ouch. Oh. For as good as the game is, that was definitely a very flat-textured skybox. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Heidegger. What a name. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. 
This pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here sucking up Marco. God, Barrett is it so animated. And it doesn't care. He's just so you aggressively, like, Marco is, amped you? up. Marco is the lifeblood of our world. The planet <laughs> they're like, needs green, they're like, we, like we know. We know, we get it. What do you think's gonna when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! Barrett, please. You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? Barrett, I please. You, you really hear that? Damn straight I do. Get help. <laughs> Get help. I just that 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 took a second to process. Get help. Damn cloud. And more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. God, he's such a fucking like he's trying to be such a badass, but because it's cloud, I can't take him seriously. Because I know he's just a dork. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. You really well, didn't need so to do that. Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> Was that a euphemism for lesbianism? <laughs> yeah. Should have asked for more money. <laughs> <laughs> she's so got the hearts for him. She fucking really likes it. Hey, how are you doing, man? Well, I'm sorry, but when a woman just goes, Oh, well, maybe there are some places a sword just can't reach. What else am I supposed to think? All right, Barrett Wallace. I didn't know that was a surname. Okay. Barrett specializes in ranged attacks. Holding down square releases a sustained burst of automatic fire. I love Wanna that. Throw your sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. Got and I can move man. around while I'm while I'm going. Um, let's see, what spells does he know? He knows thunder. Uh, yep. Ooh, okay, Barrett's unique ability is overcharge. Uh, you can deliver a heavy hitting attack that fills a large portion of his ATB gauge. Once unleashed, it takes a long time to recharge. Pressing triangle will speed up the process, though. Okay. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, I got I, I I get that. Yeah, okay. So he can use overcharge again when he wants, or he can just use normal attacks instead to kind of uh, get everything going. Uh, you can switch to different characters depending on the battle situation. Okay, that's cool. You got this. Do your job, Merc. I am. Excuse me. Uh, let's do a focus thrust on this guy. I think I missed him. Shit. Yeah, let's focus on this one. Let's focus on this one and just do a little bit of damage. Alright, let's use a fire spell on this guy up here. Just kind of knock him down. Where's the other one? There he is. Easy. His sword is five foot tall. That is true. That is true. Sure you could. I mean, Cloud's sword is basically just a giant dick joke. I mean... If, if you don't realize that by this point... Oh, this fits good. This fits really good. This fits so stupid. <laughs> Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait, guys. This is gonna be so good. One of the reasons why I love this game. Uh, you can move uh, outside of battle quickly by holding R1 or R2 to dash. So... Basically, um, you can just let yourself get hit, and every time Jessie will reply with, like, a different thing. So just keep an eye on what she says. Like, it, it's normal for now. It's normal for now. Of course it is. You know, it is what it is. See, she's laughing now. Let's, let's get a little bit closer to her so we can actually hear her a bit more. Now this is where I want to get. I want to keep getting hit. No, let me let me get hit. No, no, I'm, of course I'm not. Yeah, she's just fucking savage. 
Like, goddamn! She's just like, oh, wow. Um, <laughs> I forgot about that one! I forgot about that one! Oh, she's great. She's great. Okay, I think we're cycling through them now. Let me just double check. Yep, okay, we're cycling through now. All right, cool. So yeah, um, Cloud, boy, y dumb boy. Wait, where did she go? Oh, she went down, shit, okay. Fucking love Jessie, she's great. Oh, let me, oh, I got hit again, ow. Do you have anything to say? Nope, she's just saying the same shit, okay. I've, I've, got, I've gone through her whole, like, dialogue tree there. And now she's like, oh, you're doing good. It's, it's, it's not like, oh, you're so cool. It's more of like an, oh, you know, oh, you're doing great, sweetie. Cloud has very small brain. He is not giga brain. Ooh, it's got an angry face. Did you see the angry face? Cloud has a single brain cell and it got fucking fried after the first laser. Oh, a bottle of ether? Mmm, yum. My favorite. Ha! We can take this hunk of junk! That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that uh huh, right? yep, we rush in and we die. 100%. Mm hmm. Be sure to use potions and healing spells to regenerate HP because the game ends when all party members That's reach zero. That's a bit grim. Just saying the game ends. Uh, let's use Braver on the sweeper. While that's going on, I'm going to switch to Barret. We're going to get a little overcharge. Hitting certain enemies with certain attacks or dealing large amount of damage will temporarily knock them off balance and pressure will appear underneath their gauge. Pelt them with spells and abilities to quickly fill their stagger gauge. Once it's full, you can stagger them. Okay, that's cool. Hey, it's not moving. Let's put it down. Give it all you got. Yep, just keep just keep pressuring him. Keep pressuring him. Come on. Of course. He just had to get back up. So we knock it down again. Yeah, no we knock it down complain. again. Fire. Boom. Call it fire. Let's do this. And I'm gonna use another braver. So long. And I am gonna have. Yeah, I'm gonna have Barrett use a potion on Cloud. So we can both use potions on each other, which you know is good. We love that. Oh, he's almost done. He is so almost done. There we go. Staggered. Enemies who have been staggered are defenseless and take more damage. Use unique uh, abilities on a staggered foe to quickly boost your ATB gauge. Okay. Oh, he's done. He's done. Absolutely done. Easy. What was that rip rate? Oh, I hope there wasn't too much rip rate. Ooh, um, Avalaxion got timed out by Nightbot. Oof. I mean your age, not your goddamn rank. I. Though for all I know, a soldier's rank could be the same as his age. Guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Oof. Barrett, calm down. I didn't see the message, so I have no idea if it was a bot or not. Okay, I don't think there's any rip rate. There's a... There's a 0.8% dropped frames, which isn't terrible. Like, as long as you guys aren't, like, experiencing major buffering, we should be fine. Oh, hey, Jesse. Okay, we're just gonna keep running. Ooh, that's where we need to get to. That's that's the boss arena. That's where we're gonna fight that's a big target, boss. The reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Let's get down there. Yeah, if there's any buffering issues, just pause the the stream and just uh press play again and it's fine. For me, buffering is annoying, but I know it's from my end. Sometimes the buffering is on my end though. Like I I've got a couple of dropped frames, but I, I don't think it should be enough that there's buffering going on. Actually, I'm gonna just check. I'm actually gonna go onto Twitch myself and actually just double check this.
Just to make sure that it's definitely not like... That it's definitely not like... Okay, I can hear me. I can see me. Okay, no, it's fine. It's fine on my end. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. We're good. No, I was just checking my own specifically, that's all. Um, we good. Also, 12 viewers, welcome everybody. Welcome to the stream. Glad to see so many of you. Okay, Barrett. Okay, we got a, a tuft of phoenix down. Does that mean we just have a full phoenix down, or is that like we have a little bit of phoenix down? What's what's the what's the the, the discussion there? But I what I, I, did you call me a fucking dummy? Excuse me. You're choosing me over the reactor? That's sweet, but I'll wait my turn. Go blow her mind. Go blow her mind. What if I want to blow your mind, Jesse? Oh, we can uh, fast drop with the R1 button, which is nice. I like that. That's very relaxing. Ooh, enemies. Uh, let's run over. I was going to say, let's run over, but the run button also doubles as the guard button. So... Uh, we can't do anything with tactical, so... Let's just punish this guy. That's that. Any more enemies? Oh, oh, that's a sentry ray. That's 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 definitely a Barrett. That's a Barrett job. Go on, Barrett. You got this. There you go. Hey, Cloud is wearing gloves. I think he's fine. He's gonna at least avoid like you know ladder burn or whatever. Lovely. Ooh, nice. Ah, oh, I love fighting very basic enemies because it gives me a nice thrill. It makes me feel like I'm good. I've just noticed that my health is extremely low, so I am going to give myself a potion. That's the one thing I'm gonna- I know I'm gonna struggle with in this game, is remembering to, like, dodge and, uh, and stop attacks and shit. Come on. All done. Huh. Cocky little bastard, ain't you? Yeah, I'm very cocky. I'm allowed to be cocky. I'm a soldier. I can do what I want. Because the thing is, like, Cloud may be a nerd, but he's a cocky nerd who can back himself up in a fight. Whee! Yeah, let's do this. Let's go. Let's do the one thing Billy struggles with dodging. Hey, I'm great at dodging in Souls games. This is just a very different game. What happens on my turn-based RPG? <sighs> Barrett sniffs the All machine. Right. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Let's do it. Go on, do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. Exactly, that you're random. One of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! <sighs> Barrett has very nice teeth. I just want to say that. He has very nice teeth. I want them. <laughs> Golden Sun HD now with more hack and slash. No! Please don't do that to my beautiful Golden Sun. Oh! Oh, that's a Sephiroth feather. That's a Sephiroth feather. What's wrong? That's a feather from fucking the Walking L'Oreal Pantene Tresemme hair advertisement. What about the timer? Oh boy. You call Merc. Twenty minutes, thirty minutes. You know what? Twenty minutes. Pretty cocky, ain't you? I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna fucking lose. I'm gonna fucking lose the first boss fight. <gasps> you double crossing! That's not me! Don't just assume it's me. Heads up. What in the hell? It's a feather from an even bigger emo. It's got reinforced armor plated. Ow. But the internals can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Huh. No other option, huh? Oh, and the person with lightning magic is Barrett. Okay. Oh shit! Did I just? 
Did I just hear Cloud swear? Did I just hear Cloud go shit? I think I did. Cloud. All right. Thunder. Because Thunder works on this guy. All right, let's switch over to Cloud for a little bit. I want to give him a little bit of time on the in the spotlight. All right, he's pressured, which means we can use some abilities. Uh, that being said, my ability is going to be healing. That's my favorite ability. Gotta heal up. And I'm also going to heal Barret. Don't overdo it. Because I want Barret to be using his thunder attacks. Because his thunder attacks are the attacks that do the most damage on this boy. You know? Oh, he's moving. He's, he's, he's jumped away. Golden Sun, but it is a tile matching game like Cooney Pop. No! No, 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 no. Don't you do that to my beautiful Golden Sun. I will fight you all. No, no. No, 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 no. I don't want this. I don't want this in my life. Um, I'm going to do some damage. That's what I'm going to do. Alright, Thunder! Let's go! Thunder the boy. Oh, wait, what? Am I aiming at, like, the wrong spot? Are there multiple locations that I can aim for with this? Ah, I need to aim for the field generator. Okay, no, I don't need to aim for the field generator. Cloud needs to aim for the field generator. Shit, I'm confused. I've already confused myself, fuck. Um, Braver on the field generator. That's, that's not, that's not what I want. That's really not what I want. Some enemies will occasionally bind your party members if your character is bound, switch to a different character. Cool, cool, cool. Funny way to ask for help. Okay, let's let's just let's heal, let's heal Cloud, and let's just like not panic. Was just about to get you out. I wasn't expecting you to do Jack. Ooh, the aggression. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be shooting here. Am I hitting? Am I hitting the weak spot now? Am I actually hitting it? Uh, okay. It's up there now, so this is a Barrett situation. Ooh, nice bit of damage there. Hello again. Cloud, distract it. Ow! I'm so I'm like I'm gonna be real. There's a lot going on on screen right now, and I'm 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 kind of like having to kind of just take my time to kind of get it, you know? Like there's a lot going on, so I need to I need to just kind of focus a little bit. That's all. I apologize if I'm not reading chat, by the way. I swear I will soon. Just give me a second. Let me just burn this boy with fire, please. No, I don't want another barrier. Go away. Uh, let's switch to Barret. Uh, ooh, focus shot. Okay. Uh, do that on the field generator, please. Uh, I don't want that. I want to switch to Barret. You think I care about a few cuts and bruises? Because I don't. Oh god, I keep pressing X to like dodge, and that's not the dodge button. God damn it. Come on. You'd think that this thing would destroy the plant all by itself. Honestly. It's not most um useful of these uh Ow ow. 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 Ow, that hurt. I'm I'm upset. That was painful. Alright, let's switch to Cloud and let's just do some damage on the weak spot, shall we? That's not the dodge button. That's not the dodge button, Billy. Alright, let me just use Braver on this guy now that we've got him uh, pressured a little bit. There we go. And then I'm going to use a fire as well. I'm not going to use fire. Barret's also not going to use fire. Cool, that's good. We're doing really well, guys, as you can see. Um, 
both of our characters are in a lot of pain. Oh, we went suck on this! Oh my god, that's so relatable. Oh my god. Alright. I'm gonna use Cure on myself. I don't know how much... I'm gonna use Cure on myself. I'm not gonna use Cure, I have no MP. Well, fuck. I guess Barrett just doesn't have a lot of MP, which makes sense. Okay, that's cool. Uh, consume all ATB charges to unleash a concentrated a birth of a uh, thing. Uh, let's use Steel Skin. Just so we can do a little bit, uh... A little bit more here. Cloud can't do shit right now, but it's staggered! Okay, cool. Uh, taking damage and staggering enemies fills your limit gauge. Ooh. Oh, that's good. I, I did not realize that limit gauge uh, was a thing that we were going to be able to do. You lose your MP for casting a spell, you get hit. That makes sense. It just means, like, use your spell when you're careful and you're safe, you know? I'm so used to Kingdom Hearts where you can kind of just drop a spell while you're kind of, like, mid-attack, you know? Watch the tail. You don't want to be hit by that laser. Huh? So, what do we do? Don't get hit. Take cover behind that debris. Oh, no. There we go. We have taken cover. Alright, yep, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Oh, right, I don't have any MP, right, of course. Um, let's use an ether on Barrett then, shall I? That way, I can thunder him. Alright, let's switch to let's switch to Cloud. Let's do some damage with Cloud. I think we'll be fine. I think I think we'll be okay. I don't I don't see us losing this. Because I'm gonna use my cross slash limit break. Oh, you're as good as dead. Oh, look at that damage. Wasn't actually as much damage as I was expecting, but that's still da- uh, Ow, 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 ow. That's still damage. No holding back. Uh, let's use a potion. All good. Come on. God, I am so not used to this style of battle. I'm enjoying myself, though. I'm having fun. Take cover where? Well, that was probably not my best move. That really was not my best move. Uh, I'm gonna use Cure on Barra. I'm gonna let him heal himself. There we go. Alright, Cloud, I would like you to use that so that we can get some stagger up. Do a little bit more damage. Maybe do a bit of Braver. Hey, we are memorizing attack patterns. Excuse me. We're memorizing attack patterns very well. Oh, I have to actually be close to him. He doesn't run up to him. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, I see. In Operator Mode, cl uh, mode Cloud is very... Uh, very slow, actually. Alright, we've got this lovely cutscene going on. I think this is actually, like, the bit where we have to kind of kill it now, otherwise bad things happen. Oh, hey, what's it doing now? An auto repair unit. Damn it. We gotta take it out quicker, we're screwed. <laughs> oh, I am way ahead of you, Alright, let's go. I'm gonna blow this bastard the hell up, and that's a problem. <laughs> God, there's so much going on right now, Jesus Christ. My Gotta time our attacks just right. Hold out until you spot an opening. I mean, I feel like I spot an opening. I feel like the opening is just let's hit the fucker. You know? Like, yes, the EMP build field just knocked me back. But I feel like that that like I am, you know, doing well enough. There we go, a little bit more damage. A little bit more braver here. I think we're fine. I think we're good. I think we've won. We're so close to destroying it now. Oh, I got away just in time that time. I, I saw it coming this time. I was ready 
for that EMP field. Don't let up. There we go, it's done. It's done. Easy. Totally easy. We didn't heal so many times that I was like sure I was going to die. It's okay, we don't have a healer on our team yet. Once we get like Aerith, I think we should be fine. Though that's for a while, so we probably won't get her tonight. Set the bomb. Yes, yeah, set the bomb off. The bomb has been set. Okay, shall we leave? Shall we fuck off? Shall we do the run? Huh? You hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. All right, Barrett's left the party. Okay. All right, it's just me. It's just Cloud. All right, let go. We have got 19 minutes to escape from this facility. If we fail, we die. God damn, that, we've really been streaming for almost an hour already. Holy shit. It didn't feel that long. Concentrate. Oh, you know, I'll fight. All right. I'm down. I'd, I'd like some experience. Yes, please. No, no, no. We're going to do a uh, fire. No escape. I'm not going to complain about some extra Nothing XP. Yeah, this game has a lot of cutscenes and a lot of gameplay, but that's okay, because it gives me more time to kind of chill between, like, everything going on. Which I, I very much prefer. Oh. Jesse, you okay? Oh, shit. We're gonna go fucking rescue Jesse. That's what we're gonna do. Excuse me. There is no way we are letting Jesse go down. Aww. My hero. My hero, hey, Academia. We'll link up over there. Look after Jesse. Yeah, that's cool. I'll look after Jesse. I mean, to be fair, she's probably gonna look after me more than I'm looking Come after her. But you know, this that's cool. Lead us straight to probably. probably. Maybe. I think I see an exit. If we're lucky. Give me a sec. Give me a second, Jesse. I I know that like you know we're like in the middle of drama, but I I just need to make sure I'm getting all the good items. Don't look back. Let's go look no, no 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 no. There's a chest. There's a chest. I need to open the chest. Let me open the chest. Thank you. Damn, okay, Cloud. Aww. Oh, there's Barrett. I guess we're gonna link up to him from uh, up here, yeah. I didn't realize we were literally following him, like, step for step. Ooh, enemies, let's go. Ooh. Oh, soldier boy, let's go! Do 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 do. Soldier boy. They're here. Take them down. But I don't have Barrett as a teammate. Barrett is kind of just doing his own thing, and that's okay. Uh, okay. Um, I'm gonna just use a fire on that guy over there. There we go. Easy. Cloud is such an emo. He really is. He is full emo. He is, like, the most emo that emo has ever been. He is... Oh, oh fuck, another one of these. Okay, well, that's fine. I don't mind fighting one of these. That's cool. Alright, he's been pressured. It's peer pressure right now. She's braver because it's like just a nice slam attack. We like that. Uh, let's have Barrett use focus shots. 
and easy. Like, once it's staggered, it pretty much is, like, the end of the match. Like, you've won. As far as I can tell. Because, like, look at how much health it's got left. It's not surviving this. There we go. Huh. Easy. Uh, that's not the elevator. This is the elevator, yes. Are we not taking that? Oh, no, we're going up the stairs. Shit, I'm an idiot. I forgot there were stairs. Fuck, 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 fuck. Cloud is depressed emo, whereas Sephiroth is, like, just full-on, like, I go to Hot Topic emo, you know? Let's lock on and let's just do some nice big booms. Was never in doubt. I'm confusing goths and emos. They're basically the same thing. They were both treated the same in high school. Oh, a shock trooper. Okay, you're new. You're new, but you've been hit now, so... Sucks to be you. Let's try a fire on it. Let's see if maybe, like, um... Yeah, okay, so using sh uh, spells on those guys uh, does uh, extra damage and gets them out of, like, their dodgy-dodgy phase, which is always good. We don't like dodgy-dodgies. Jesus, so many enemies. Oh, my God. It's almost like we're doing something illegal, and we need to be stopped. Okay, I don't know why I keep pressing X. Ow! I'm not gonna bleed out. I'm too cool to bleed out. Uh, you know what? No, I'm actually gonna use Barrett. I'm gonna use Barrett's Cure to heal Cloud. There we go. Nice little bit of health from the Cure there. God, there's so much going on right now. I'm, once again, finding it very hard to keep track of, like, everything that's going on. This is very much uh, a battle system that I am going to need to learn. And that I need to respect. If I give it the time it deserves, then it will treat me very well. Alright, yeah, let's get back into normal mode. Might have more luck in normal mode. Please stop dodging, it's annoying. We don't like that when you dodge. Yeah, I I, I know I'm gonna get used to the battle system. I will. It, it was the same with Xenoblade. Like, I struggled at the start and then I got used to it. It's fine. No time to celebrate. Uh, must be hard streaming this game of commentary and all. A lot is happening. I, yes. Yes, it is very difficult. I'm sure it will get easier when I kind of get more used to everything going on. If you don't know everything, you're fucked. Great. I love that. I love that about this game. Yo, we broke your reactor. How you doing, man? Oh, right. Yeah, okay. So, all we did was a tiny bomb. We just did a tiny little bomb. But they have decided, you know what? We're gonna blow the entire building up and make it look like we blew up the entire building, thus making us into pure-ass terrorists. So, like, we did, like, this tiny little bit of destruction, but in reality... Come on, come on, come on. Um, they've made it worse so that they can blame it on us, basically. Government things. Yeah, they have phones. This is, um, like a cyberpunk, steampunk sort of society. They have electricity and stuff. Oh, hey, Jesse. Hey, Queen. 
Ooh, everything's fucking shaken. And I bet these guys are all gonna think, oh, we did this. Woo! Hey, J Jesse, you're okay, you're okay, you're okay, you're all right, you're all right. You're good. If I couldn't, believe me, you'd be the first to know. You going into this blind? I know the story. I don't know the gameplay. Like, I know I know Final Fantasy VII story, and I watched a lot of gameplay of this back when it first came out, but I don't remember jack shit because it's been like six months. Okay, that was pretty cool. All right, come on. Let's go, Jesse. Yeah, the government are gonna blame us for this. Like, that's a pretty serious set of explosions. And we're gonna get blamed for that shit. Mm. Beautiful. Love some explosions, you know. Uh, Midgar, powered by eight giant Mako reactors that were erected by the Shinra Electric Power Company, Midgar is known as the city of Mako. Rising 300 meters above ground level, the steel plates surrounding the Shinra but Okay, well. Fuck my lore, I guess. Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to Chapter 2, Fateful Encounters. Nice. Think you might have overdone it. I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Nah, we got we got um set up, but we're not gonna know that, are we? But the planet's what matters, right? I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. Oh, they're all so happy. Right happy away. and cheerful. You Nothing bad it. could ever happen to these characters, I'm sure. <laughs> Nothing bad in the slightest. At least not now, anyway. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere. Let me just check. Is there any, like, collectible items back here that I can collect? I just want to have a look. The air nope. Air reeks. Not at all. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so fine. <laughs> it's you. Oh, it's me. Yeah, I'm fucking so exactly. I'm soon. Made my joke for me, man. A little bit of self-deprecating humor. That's how you know it's a 2020 game. <laughs> Felt that one in my guts. <laughs> Just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? No, it wasn't hey, you. Figure that out later. Jesse. I've never seen this game, but I just want Wedge to die. Wedge is the nice one. Wedge is the big boy. Rude. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. Wedge is Presh Boy. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. You're the I'll reason we on. can't have nice things, Jack. Ooh. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. Oh, and he's coming out with the Billy Smug. The Billy Grin. She's good to go. Hopefully that one doesn't blow the entire city up. <laughs> I have learned nice people die. Yeah, let's not piss off Jessie. I feel like if she could, she could crush me under her heels, and honestly, I wouldn't be mad. I've seen Full Metal Alchemist. I am not a simp. I am just admitting that she is a powerful being, and she could probably crush me under her feet and I would not be able to complain about it because she's aggressive. Sector 8 Business District, nice. Trust me, Cra Cloud is not interested. He ain't interested at all. He's too busy being brooding. Yeah, sorry guys. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. Merc's right. Mmm. 
It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor. Obese Rob, hello. My break wanted to catch as much stream as I could and say hi. Hello, welcome, man. Yeah. We always knew this was gonna get messy. I want him to die. This is only the beginning. Just because he's the least likable of the three. They're all likable, but. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Ooh, Barrett. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you to help take the load off your shoulders. See, Barrett is such a fucking politician. Your he would be fantastic as a politician. But no, he's like, I'm gonna be an eco terrorist. Your fees. Whatever your problem. I got you. So amazing. So, what's her Would he build a wall? Boss? No, he'd probably tear down the fucking wall. He doesn't want walls. He wants we everyone to be happy. <sighs> Politicians don't save the world, Billy, but Barrett does. I truly believe that if Barrett ran as a politician, he would achieve world peace. He might have to, like, you know, shoot a few people, but that's fine. Alright, bye everybody, hey. goodbye. I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. Alright. White light, hello man. Oh, sorry, not white light. White eye. Wall of trees, maybe. Mmm, yes. A wall a wall of good old-fashioned O2 creators. Uh, how did they make this minor character from Kingdom Hearts and give him his own game? No, Jack. No, you're going to upset all the fans. Oh. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? It's a materia orb. Of course not. It's healing materia. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job. Nothing more. Cloud, just take the fucking materia. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, it helps your weapon. You Cloud, she wants to fuck you. Survival can be a matter of luck. Cloud, she wants to fuck you. And you can't rely on luck. Cloud, she wants to what fuck you. Uh, yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? God, okay. Uh, you can now set materia to your weapons and armor. Um, I'm gonna begin the tutorial because I've never done it before. So yeah, go in there. Triangle to set materia. Select an empty slot. Pop one in. And then boom. It's very simple. Very straightforward. Okay. I was only trying to help. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. Oh. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Oh, I love her. I love her so much. She's just so charismatic and lovable. Are there any trains going to the slums? Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know why you're kind of just hiding in, like... Well, actually, yeah, actually, that makes sense, because, you know, everything is, like, on fire and shit. Maybe the, the hiding makes sense now that I think about it. How's everyone doing today, by the way? Those of you that are tuning in. Tifa's still better, though. Mm, I mean, we'll see Tifa when we see her. I don't actually remember much about her characterization in this, so I will be very interested to see. God, there's so much. Where? Oh, there she is. Hey, Jesse. Careful up here. This could collapse at any moment. If you want up, you'll have to use those stairs. Eh. My office. Why did this have to happen to us? Aww. Mate, you look like you've got your your maid. You've got money. You're fine. You. I mean, you look a little bit depressed. I mean, get rid of the purple hairband. Get rid of that hairband. That hairband is no. That hairband is ugh, awful. What do you want? I do a top side resident because there are top sides and bottom sides in Midgar. We're in top side at the moment, which is where all the the people that are rich. Or the people that, um, society likes stays. And then bottom side is where all the people, um, we don't like live. Uh, or the, the, the government doesn't like live, but we like them. We like all the people bottom side. 
Billy, you're really judging random people on the streets. I can do what I want. This is my stream. If I want to tell people they look ugly and their fashion sense is awful, I'm going to tell them that. I mean, just look at this woman. I'm sorry, but that green with that blue with that white with those blue shoes? No. Get the green shoes. Have it match your top. It would look so much better. Oh my god. Holy shit. Yes, bottom side is the slums, pretty much. Yes. That is exactly it. Stations intact. Okay. Everything over here is looking good. People just probably fucking died there. 100% people probably just fucking died there. Oh no. Oh. Oh no, Cloud's gonna have a fucking PTSD because he's like fire. Oh, my backstory. Oh. Oh. Right, I think his I think his home is called Niflheim, I think. Or something. Oh, and there he is. There is Mr. L'Oreal Hair himself. Just getting this scene in so early, like holy shit. Oh shit! Why are you here? Why are you here so early? You're not meant to be here right now! You are not meant to be here! He is not meant to be here this early! He is not meant to be here! He had hair spa before this scene came up. Like, this is, this is remake stuff, this is not original stuff, because obviously, like, the remake kind of assumes that you know the story of the original going in. Like, it's very much a game that was made for the fans. And Sephiroth definitely was not meant to appear there at that point, but oh well. We're dealing with it. Now come back, come back Sephiroth, come back. I need to ask you about hair care tips. Gotta go later, no problem Obese Rob, thanks for hanging out then. Why did they add Matt Mercer to anime? I don't fucking know. Ooh. Wait. Come on Cloud, come on. Cloud doesn't need hair care tips. I mean, that's true. But compared to Sephiroth, his hair looks dirty. Okay, this is a very slow sequence. Okay, we're in cutscene mode now. There he is. Is he gonna say anything? You're dead. I am. Ooh, he speaks. Kind of gay, man. That was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Oh shit! Our beloved planet is dying. Oh no! Slowly. He's also an eco terrorist. Suddenly, painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Oh, he's got like cat eyes. I hate it. I don't like it. Oh yeah, for those of you that don't know, Sephiroth basically burned down uh, Cloud's hometown. Murdered everybody. Okay, Sephiroth. Yeah, Sephiroth is kind of a dick. We don't like him. Except we love him, really. Like, we love to hate him, but I love him. Such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Okay. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Suck Run this dick. Cloud. Run away. Nope. Okay. You have to leave. You have to live. Oh, that smile. Ugh. You Cloud's so angry. I was like, oh, don't you dare tell me to live. Very good. 
hold on to that hatred. Ooh. Sephiroth is basically Cloud, but his sword is like the length of like a fucking city block. Like you think that like Cloud's sword is thick, whereas Sephiroth's sword is long. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. You know. All right, you got this. Yeah, Cloud, you're one hundred percent seeing things. One hundred percent. One fucking hundred percent, you are seeing things that totally didn't happen. That's fine. Believe that. Oh, look at all these people who are upset. I'm gonna miss my train. Oh, shut the fuck up about your train. No one gives a fuck. Oh, that's the Makoto voice actress from uh from from Persona 5. I recognize her. Honey. Honey, please get up. You look a bit depressed. Also, man, take that hat off your head. It's disgusting. Oh, Nightbot. Nightbot is... I'm sorry, Nightbot is very brutal. I, I keep trying to tweak him every stream, but he just gets very brutal. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Please leave your residences at once. Man. God. What an absolute mess. God, everyone's like, oh, it's the end of the world. No, trust me, you have not seen the end of the world yet, but trust me, you will probably in the sequels. Oh. Fatal Calamity, welcome, man. Nightbot just is Skynet. It's just a fact. There we go. Ooh, 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 I know what's happening. I know what's happening next. I know what's happening next. But, but I want to get whatever that purple thing is over by that car. Wow. I know what happens next. I know what happens next because look over there. Do you see, do you, do you guys see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see best girl? Do you see the best girl in the game? Do you see best girl over there? I see best girl. Best girl, hello! Oh! Best girl is very afraid right now. I don't actually remember what this is about, so that's fun. Oh, no, Sephiroth, please leave best girl alone. Like, the last time you were near her in the original, we're not talking about that, but... Leave her alone. Too weak to save anyone. Don't say that now! Not even yourself. Don't say that when you just walk past Aerith! Fuck you, game! The game knows exactly what it's doing with that line, holy shit. I'm fine. Cloud, pay attention to Here, your future love. This is for you. I've never played the Yakuza series. It's not really something that interests me. What things? Huh? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. I fucking love her. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. I assume that most of you guys wait. Wait. Oh, it's a theme. It's a theme. I'm assuming most of you know what happens to Aerith in the original game. It's kind of like the Luke, I am your father of video games. Oh. Uh. Okay, you know what? I'm g No, how much? I'll take it. I'll take it. How much? I'm not going to be an asshole to Aerith. Well, that depends on the customer. In your case, <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Oh, that! Ooh, ooh, that means a lot when you when you know that crisis call. That means a lot. Ooh. I'm involved in things, dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? Oh. So keep your distance. Wait, 
You think someone's out to get you? Oh. Uh, what you're all worked up about? Aerith, please. Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self. Oh shit. Oh? Oh shit. Oh, she's touched us and we can see things. Ooh, look at all of the, the, the look at the dementors from Harry Potter. Holy shit. Sorry, we're not allowed to mention Harry Potter because, you know, JK Rowling's cancelled. Um Um oh fuck, what else can we describe them as? Um Oh, I don't I don't know what else to describe them as. Fuck. Oh no. I don't know what these things are either. They were not in the original. The, these are not in the original. You know, you're right. And she's like, I'm a run. Bye. Oh, so she's gonna... Nice yep, so she's running. They're gonna follow her, which means that we just have to deal with these guys with the fucking red eyes. Fucking Tom Clancy looking asses. Right now. Do you know what Harry Potter house you are? A uh, Ravenclaw. Oh, it's the battle theme. I don't know if we had the battle theme before. Um, it's Cloud's theme. It's it's the it's the battle theme of the original game. I don't remember if we had this um, when we were fighting in the 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 reactor. That's that. Not bad. I did it. Look at me being good at the game. Aerith, where did you go? Honey. Honey, where are you? There's a chest over here, but there's no Aerith. She really just said, I'm going to run into an alleyway with no exit and escape. Oh, maybe I can run that way now and um, grab whatever that purple thing was by the uh, by the car. Yep. Or not. Let me kill the dog first. Sorry, not kill the dog. We're just gonna we're just gonna knock the dog out. Okay? We're not gonna kill the dog. Maim the dog, yes. Exactly. We would never kill a dog. It sure looks like you're killing it. Well, you need to check your eyesight, methinks. Ooh, hello. An orb of HP up materia. Oh, so that's what those are. Okay. Is there anything else, like, down here that we can take a look at? Anything else? No? Okay, back the way we came, then. Cool, cool. I'm only brutally attacking it with a sword. I'm hitting it with the dull end of the blade. Let's go with that. Oh, and I know I know that voice actor. That's the voice actor of fucking um, Eric from Zero Time Dilemma and Shido from Persona 5. And I'm starting to realize a lot of the same voice actors voice the same people in English media. An orb of deadly dodge materia. I love that name. Uh, what's down here? This looks like um, uh, a dead end area. Perfect for me. Yeah, we just killed your dad. I'm sorry. And now I'm going to fire you. Ha, burn. Sick burn, bro. You can put those materia in your sword right now. Oh, I know, I'm, I'm sure I can. I, I'm just... I want to kill these dogs first. I mean, uh, main... The, I mean, um... Fight these dogs first. Ha ha ha. Oh, I leveled up. Nice. Alright, let me have a little look. What have we got? Uh, okay. We have HP up materia, which gives us a boost of HP, and a deadly dodge materia, which uh, increases the potency and effects of deadly dodge. Or use deadly dodge. Um, how does one deadly dodge? Oh, I see. You kind of attack while you dodge. Um, I'm probably not going to change out my fire or healing spells right now because they're fairly useful in this like sort of like opening area. But we'll see. 
I'm not killing the dog. I am not killing the dog. I'm sorry. If you guys want to think I'm killing the dog, that's completely fine. But I disagree. Uh, bronze bangle, power wrist guards. Okay, so we only have like slight armor accessories here, which I like. It means I don't have to worry too much about getting like 50 billion different fucking armor sets. Putting it into a coma. No. I'm just telling it to back down for a few minutes. Okay, I can't do anything here. Okay. Strong attack. Yep, I'm gonna focus on the doggo now. Shit. Yeah, let's, let's stick to my normal mode for now. Uh, let's use Cure, just to kind of give us a bit of healing. So I don't want to use my potions. No, I'm a good person. Why are they attacking me? I don't know. I'm just a normal dude. Like, I technically have not done anything wrong that these guys can point out. Oh, a Grenadier. Okay, I need to get rid of you then, because you're like, you're like ranged. We don't like range. go. Give us a little bit of healing. No corpse equals no murder. The dogs just went into a spacey farm somewhere. Exactly. It doesn't count if you don't find the body. Oh shit, Jesus, hello. Um, didn't see you guys. That's cool. Well. Well, I managed to hit him, which is good. I'm not really sure how to deal with these guys, though. They're quite quite tough to fight at this point in time. Uh, lock on to that. Yeah, let's lock on. I don't know why I wasn't locked on in the first place. But yeah, let's log on. Log on, lock on. Uh, let's just fire it. Just to kill him. Just to make sure he's dead, you know. And then let's use another cure, just to keep ourselves alive. I know my MP is going down, but we're fine. Because this boy is now staggered. So let's punish him. Oh shit, there's more of them. Alright, that bench is indestructible. It was. Benches do not break in this city. They are made of, like, fucking titanium alloy or some shit. Easy. Easy. Alright, let's just fucking leave. Let's just fucking run. Play with some of the ragdoll physics. Let's go. I'll go up the roof in a minute. I want to explore first. Glad to see there's 11 of you guys watching, by the way. It's always good to see um, double-digit numbers. If you have any friends who might be interested in watching this stream, please be sure to let them know that we are doing the game. And if you're not interested in Final Fantasy VII, that's completely fine. We're going to be doing Age of Calamity on the 20th. And uh, we're going to be doing uh, Dead by Daylight once a week as well. So that's fun. When the leader of a group betrays the rest, I'm reading a book series that does that, and I love it. I, I, I quite like that trope as well. I think it's a good trope when done right. I like betrayal tropes a lot, but I, I like the betrayal to be not obvious. Because there's a, a lot of the times with betrayal tropes, you kind of see it coming, and you're like, yeah, we know that person's going to betray them. Like, it's so clearly going to happen. Oh wait, shit. Can I put materia into my bangle? Shit, I can. Didn't even realize. Um, I am going to... HP up. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna stick with, like, the, the baby easy stuff. Uh, where am I going from here? I'm going this way. There we go. What am I gonna do if you haven't finished the game by the 20th? Uh, probably just kind of, like, um... Uh, alternate between the games. Like I'll figure, I'll figure it out on the twentieth, pretty much. Um, 
Because there's a very high chance I won't have finished this game by then if I'm also doing Dead by Daylight streams once a week as well. So uh, we'll, we'll figure it out if, if uh, it becomes relevant, basically. Ooh, a Riot Trooper, okay. Uh, I'm going to braver you, and it's going to hurt. Streaming tomorrow yet? Yep, I am streaming tomorrow. Tomorrow we're doing Dead by Daylight, and then on Sunday we're back to this. Fair warning, by the way. Um, some of you um, may not know, but um, next week on Friday, uh, I'm going to be ending the stream an hour early because of reasons that I'm not sure if I'm allowed to talk about yet or not, but we will see. Come on, Cloud. Oh shit, hello. Yeah, I'm, I'm mainly going to be like doing a little bit of exploring, maybe do side quests if like they are in line with everything I'm doing, but mainly I want to experience the story. Don't call me a bastard, excuse me. I was not born out of wedlock. Don't you, don't you be calling me a bastard. Gotcha. You just do multiple dodges and they don't know what to do. They just get scared. You could say he's on Cloud9. Get out, out, you've been banned from the chat for that. You have been banned for your pun. Reminder, by the way, if you are not at all, because uh, 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 this is something that started up yesterday, but if you are not in my new Discord, uh, I do have a Discord now where I update people on streams and stuff and we just chill and it's all it's all based on my Twitch. So uh, if you haven't joined that one yet, would recommend. Um, oh God, Cloud is about to die. Gonna just like... Yeah. That's the wrong button. I was pressing R1 to try and attack, but I'm like, oh yeah, R1 isn't the attack button. R1 is a different button. I'm gonna use a high potion. I need a big heal. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I'm stunned. There we go, I'm fine. Yeah, let's focus on you. I don't know why I keep thinking R1 is the attack button. It's not the attack button, Billy. Get over yourself. Please use the correct attack button. Thank you. There we go. Hey, Maya, how's the terrorism? It's going great. We're having a lot of fun. We are still on, like, the first major mission because I'm kind of just exploring the area that we're in. But, uh, yeah, the terrorism is going well. I feel like we are really helping the planet. Heals and then immediately walks into an uh, explosion. Hey, I never said... I never once said I was smart. You guys have seen me play these games enough. You know I'm not smart. Oh, well, that was probably not the best idea. Because the dog was already staggered, so there was no reason to do that again. I just got my throat ripped out by this dog. And you guys... And you guys are saying, Oh, yeah, don't, don't hurt the dog, Billy. Don't hurt the dog. The dog is good. The dog is a good boy. He just tried to chew my fucking face off. So, I don't know about you, but no. God, this fucking stun guy. Jesus, go away. Oh my god. I think he's dead. I think we actually just killed him. With the fire. Hits the doggo and uh, it took him out as well. Level 10 though, let's fucking go. It's not his fault he got brainwashed by the pigs. Exactly! Thank you, Maya! Don't complain about the doggos, Billy. They're good boys. No, my doggos are good boys and girl. These guys, they don't know what good boy and girl means. They are just aggressive. Oh, shit. 
They fucking Tokyo drifted onto the scene. Here we go. Yeah, we're totally gonna die here. 100%. That's the end of the game, guys. We go to prison. We get arrested for eco-terrorism. That's the it. Goodbye. The end. No, I don't want to. I don't want to fight you. You're the one I don't want to fight. Yeah, let's fight one of the Grenadiers. We can deal with Grenadier. Uh, I need to heal. I am going to cure. That's probably not gonna. And then I'm gonna dodge. Why do I want to keep attacking the fucking riot trooper? I don't want to fight the riot trooper game. Do you realize? that I don't like this guy, and I don't want to fight him. Yeah, no, you're not using force. You're losing force. That's what you are. Hey man, I heard you like grenades. Alright, what's the best way to deal one of these guys? Probably bait an attack out. Okay. Gotcha. Come and get it. Okay, fine. I will come and get it. Like, literally, mate, you're doing nothing. You're dead. That's what you did. I Ooh, that guy's got a red shield. That scares me. I don't like that. Ooh, you know what? Let's use Braver, but let's use it on the Huntsman. What a name. Oh, God, he blocked it. Oh, God, I got grenaded. Oh, God. I'm in pain. I'm in a lot of pain right now. Grenadier. Grenadier. Alright, I'm trying to be careful here because I'm not sure what the best strategy for these guys is. Oh, I blocked him. I blocked him and restruck, but then I got stuns, which kind of sucks. We don't like stuns. Uh, potion. And then after... Well, we have to wait. And then we'll use Braver on Riot Troop Boy here. There we go, take him out. And now we've just got the Huntsman. He's the last one left. Go on, attack me. Oh, you've left yourself wide open. Ooh, he's pressured by the fire. He doesn't like the fire. Oh, he doesn't like any of this. He's not happy right now. Oh, that's gonna go for his shield. I fucked that one up. Oh no, that didn't. That 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 went for his shield, but in the way I like. Okay. All right. There we go. There's the stagger. That's what we were after. Huntsman, more like Puntsman into the trash. Oh my god, Maya, hilarious. Are you a comedian? Oh my god. Easy. Ooh. I know that guy. The feel when you're the Huntsman and you're getting destroyed by an emo bottom. He is a bottom, that's true. I forgot about that. He is a complete fucking bottom. Look at that fucking baby twink ass face. Oh, now he runs. Yeah, now he runs. Kiss Cloud won't be joining us after all. Oh no, he made it. Don't worry. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn, Goddamn one man army. <laughs> You think he's a keeper? I want him. Jesse wants him, clearly. It's just Cloud. Close the door. I'm getting very nervous. What the hell you been up to? Barrett was actually like worried. Aww. 
That's what. That Barra almost let his facade slip. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> There Wait. we go. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? No. Uh, what? What is Cloud's what hair knows? routine? I don't know. Everyone went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. And she. Weapon, maybe. <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. No. Excuse me. Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Just having to readjust on, my beanie a bit. Because my uh, ear is feeling a bit blocked. It tends to happen when I stream with headphones and beanie on. A lot of people here. Oh. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? This Lucky us. From we've got a crowd to hide. Yeah, we, we've we've actually got a reason to like be safe now, because there are people here. Just chilling in these cars. I love that someone at Square was like, let's just name these characters after Luke Skywalker's wingmen, not once, but twice. Multiple times, like Biggs and, uh, like I'm pretty sure Biggs and Wedge are, they have been in Final Fantasy like pretty much every game. Like them and Sid are like names that are just constantly used. It's just a, like referenced. Oh, look at all these people. Oh, God, put some... Oh, I like I like her outfit. She's cool. Put some fucking colors on. Holy shit, you're all so dark and dreary. Where are the lime greens? Do you have anything to say? You're uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8. I'm a soldier. <laughs> wow. My hands are still shaking. Get over it. Get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. Aww. No, we need color. What you need? And it didn't. Trust me, it didn't. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail safes to prevent that kind of thing? You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. No, I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own. No, <sighs> Gotta own up to you were good. I'm gonna go talk to Wedge as well. I realized I skipped Thanks, him. Cloud. You're a good listener. <laughs> I'm a good listener because I don't like talking to people because I'm antisocial and brooding. Ooh. Hey, Wedge. Man, everyone's on edge. Everyone's on Wedge. They are. Hey, Cloud. Can't no I, um, hotels if you're about there. to unburden yourself, don't. <laughs> Yeesh. You don't make it easy. Wait, where is it? Damn, I feel bad. Jesse, he's like, fine, I'll listen to you. Wedge, it's like, don't you fucking dare or I will cut you with this goddamn sword. Damn, Cloud, with the double standards. Oh, no. Barrett, what are you doing? What kind of maniac? Go so far as to bomb a reactor. Oh no. Uh, they've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? No. Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. <laughs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Barrett really being subtle here. Just who do you think you are? Really being subtle here. Law-abiding concerned citizen. <laughs> Law-abiding? Really? Don't you judge me just because I have a gun for an arm. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. Ooh. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. How did nobody figure out that Barrow was the fucking leader of Avalanche? Look at this man. We will not submit to intimidation or violence. Yeah, fuck off. Work together for peace and prosperity. Yeah, fuck off. That is how civilized people change the world. You know it isn't. Trust me, it really isn't. <laughs> These people are like, oh, we voted for Trump 2020. Words. It's 
what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? You don't have a conscience. Fuck off. We should go. Right. <laughs> Barrett, don't kick the goddamn chair. It makes you look like an angry toddler. You have to be humble in defeat, I guess. I'll talk to you in a minute. I want to see what's over here first, Barrett. I want to see if I can go through here or not. Can I? Nope. Oh, hi, Jesse. Fucking hell, where did you come from? Oh, and the others followed me in as well. Okay. Uh, okay, Barrett. That suit shouldn't retrieve my ass. We're the good guys, damn it. You hear yeah. that suit shouldn't retrieve my ass. Oh, that's it. Okay, so he's, he's literally just upset. We can't deal with him. Okay, cool. Jesse. What do you want to do? Oh, bye, Personally, Jesse. I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. He's just brooding. He's just being grr. An initiation right. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not <laughs> such a thing as playing too hard to get. <laughs> so, a wireframe model of the great city of Nishar, complete with massive steel plates, He's not playing too hard to get, Jesse. He's just really not interested. Which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors. Which feed the insatiable appetite. Jesse, he really just doesn't want the, the V. I'm pretty sure he might be gay. Shortly. <laughs> this here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They Cloud is asexual. Cloud doesn't want to fuck anything. Of all passengers heading in and out. If anything, Cloud just wants to fuck his sword. status, criminal history. All that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Ooh. Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. Cloud is buster sexual. Have a little faith. Cowboy Cloud. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Great big pizza in Shoot the sky. Marco, while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> it's an option. That's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's yeah, but that's like running. Good. Those are running words. It's only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Which one of his swords? Chat, you are horny today. Stop it. Get your minds out of the gutter. Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. To the rest of the game, yes, Cloud. That's correct. Congratulations. Map of Midgar. Pressing options on the map screen will display a fully rotatable 3D map of Midgar. The perfect tool to help orient yourself in this enormous city. There's no escaping you're in the gutter. God damn it. Uh, an organized group of slum residents dedicated to protecting the town in lieu of Shinra. Okay. Um, no, okay. Home sweet slum. I love that. Oh, still alive? Whoa. Crazy, dude. It, it's very, um, I lived bitch energy. Hot damn, we are good! Yes! Bombs one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a... Well, Wedge is fucking yeah. jinxed it, God damn it. Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Coming from Barrett. Coming from Barrett. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? <laughs> All right. See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works. Oh, we're gonna get to see Don't our girl. To worry. We're gonna get to go see our grill, best grill, Miss Tifa of the Lockhart. I think that's her name, Tifa Lockhart. Yeah. 
Nearly wife time. I mean, personally, my wife is Aerith, but you know what? I will not... I will not say that Tifa stands are bad, because Tifa is honestly just as good a choice. Can I break this box? Nope, I can't even attack. Okay. Alright, welcome to the slums, everybody. So yeah, the... Todd Habercorn, is that you? I know, I, I I know that voice anywhere. Um, yeah, the city is up there, basically. We are underneath the city, pretty much, which uh, is not the best place to be in. And they call them Platies, aww. Oh? Who are you? Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Hell it is. Oh fuck off! This guy does yeah. not have that voice. That d that is Dumbass not that guy's voice. Fuck right off! He looks way too young to have that voice. Who is best boy? Red thirteen. You trying to tell me that's not progress? But you know we don't see him till the end of the game. Ooh. What the? You okay, buddy? Cloud, you okay? Mako junkie, huh? Figures. Oh no, not the Dementors again. I don't want them. God, the Dementors really don't like us. You again. All right. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. Oh, the fucking people. You oh shit, those three. I Fuck, know. I didn't even see them. Figure out how I screwed up? Huh. You're such a kidder. Sector 7 slums. Ah, oh, welcome to the slums, everybody. Where people just dance in the street for no reason, because why not? Oh, and we're being led straight to Tifa. We aren't even getting the choice to follow anyone else. They're just like, go to Tifa. Go to, go to her now. There she is! There she is! Marlene. Oh? Oh yeah, Marlene is um, Barrett's daughter. And she is like, she is like the most precious thing in the world. And we all fucking love Marlene, okay? We love her. <laughs> Huh. Oh, you did, did you? Hey, bandit, Frenchie well, fries, welcome, man. <laughs> Both of you. You made it. Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. I got it from a grill. <laughs> huh? uh, don't give her ideas, Cloud. You're giving her ideas. How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? Yellow flower lost. Guys, Has been five years. <laughs> I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. We love Tifa, but we love Marlene even more. Marlene is the best girl in this game, you know what? That's 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 a fucking fact. Don't you worry about all this. I love her voice actress. Because it's just a fucking child, I'm pretty sure. This is precious. These two are precious. Hello! What the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? <laughs> Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> oh. That's right, honey. I do say that. What a so cute. Girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. Barrett just goes from I'm gonna fuck you up to sweetie, it's okay. Just stay it. Just be all right. You're good. Daddy's got you. Oh, it's so precious. I want to talk some more, Daddy. He's a gentle giant. That's basically what he is. He's a gentle giant, but he has a temper. Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. The still waiting on it. Uh, right. Cloud, I think she meant, what drink do you want? We should talk outside. Oh? Hey, 13 viewers. Welcome, everybody. Um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Aww. Let that be a lesson to you. 
Marlene, do you want to chat? You want to chat with me? I'm not a stranger. I'm not a stranger, Marlene. Why? Outside, you say. <laughs> Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. Aww. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Yeah, sounds sure good. Does. In this economy. Nice. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? Oh. Oh, it was the hatch. We can escape dead by daylight. Come on, get through the hatch. Get through the hatch. Come on, Cloud. Get away from the killer. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. Is that blood? I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to I can't tell if that's blood or sh that's spray paint. That can't be blood. It's too red to be blood. Blood is more crimson dark, you know. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Hmm. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You don't have a key, Billy. You, you can't get through the hatch. Worry. I haven't. You I haven't fixed all the generators person. yet. I'll give you that. <laughs> do, 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 do. I saw Sector Eight on the news. It was like a war zone. We didn't mean the to blow it up that much. We'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells you to. Sector so. Seven? It wasn't that bad. Um. Oh, right. Kind of, we kind of fucked up a little bit, but you know, it's only because the government is, you know, trying to pin a conspiracy and on us, pretty much. Are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Take me to my home. Room two hundred one here is where I sleep. Ah. Don't have time for much else. What with seventh heaven and all. Well, I'll come in. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. You sure you don't want me to come in? I, I, I can, I, Tifa, I can, I can come in. Tifa. Tifa, I can come in. Here's your room, 202. Right next Don't door. Worry. I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Uh, oh, no spoilers, please. I, I mean, I know, like, the basic Final Fantasy VII story, play? um, Was but just in case much? there are people in the chat who maybe no. have never seen this game or know Final Fantasy VII story, let's keep spoiler free that for them. Uh, know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. Okay. So I can't go in there. What are you doing? You've never even met this person. I like he's saying that to himself. That's fucking adorable. What are, what are you doing, Cloud? What are you doing? I've, I've never I've never even met that person. Oh my god. Artwork of Cloud smiling, but that's just that's fan art. That's not real. It's fan fiction. Oh god, the textures on the door. What the fuck? Why are they so blurry? I forgot this game has a few texture issues here and there. to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always get it. There's one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? God damn, Cloud, getting straight to the money. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, Aww. so I can pay you after. Cloud, be nice. And you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. Cloud, she's having no, so much trouble. Just enough. be nice. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves 1500 You're the best. No, the best would be if he I'll just said, fine, I'll waive the, the price. But no, he everything. didn't. Sleep tight. All right, Tifa's gone behind the badly textured door. Great. So basically, I think this game had a few texture issues when it launched, and I don't know if they've all been fixed. But most of it looks pretty damn good. There's just a few moments where, like, the textures go a bit wonky. Oh, he's not even got a cover on him. Put on a cover. <sighs> Guess it's time for introductions. Oh boy. What is going on with our neighbor? Oh, everything is like suspiciously silent here. There's just one dude fucking chilling on the. Ra that is a person. I'm gonna go and have a look at that. That's a person just chilling on the railing. Let me go and have a look at that, please. 
No, I want to... I want to go look at the fucking dude who's just, like, passed out on a fucking bench over there. Holy shit. Actually, let me just... I just saw something on my phone. I just want to quickly check this. Um, apparently someone left a YouTube comment for me. And I want to just quickly take a look at it, because it might be funny. Also, we might be getting some dropped frames right now. I've just noticed that the dropped frames meter has gone up a little bit. Um... Oh, uh, someone on my Golden Sun for Switch video is saying, this is a delusional, let it go, it's never going to happen. They'll be wrong next year, but that's fine. Uh, yeah, we're getting some dropped frames, fuck, okay. Um, what can I do, what can I do, what can I do? Um, hmm. Ah! I don't know what to do about them. There's not really much I can do, except maybe, like, try and close the things that use the... Uh, the internet on my on my PC. So close Discord, close that, close this. Maybe that will help. Could just do with a quick restart of the stream. That could also work. Uh, that's annoying. It's annoying because there's not really much I can do about dropped frames. I just kind of have to deal with it. I can maybe try changing some settings, but... Hmm. Uh, let me just quickly check my internet speed real quick, just to, just to, to see how it's going. Cause it could just, it could just be maybe that this game is very intense for streaming, but I should check my internet speed just to see if it's, uh, if it's holding up. Ooh, ooh, the download is not good. Jesus, that is low. That is way lower than it should be. Hmm. I may need to restart the stream quickly. That might be a thing. So my download is at 13 Mbps, when usually it's around 60, so that's not good. All right, yeah. I think I'm gonna restart the stream, guys. Um, what we're gonna do, actually, is rather than just restart, um, I'm gonna go into my uh, Walking Dogs BRB screen. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, um, stop the stream for about five minutes, uh, go grab myself a cup of tea, um, come back, and then hopefully when I restart the stream, the dropped frame should be gone, and we should be able to just continue, uh, and we'll, we'll see what happens when we get back. So, I'll be back in about five minutes, if anyone comes into chat and is like, where's the stream, just let them know, five minutes, and yeah, we will be back, uh, soon. So yeah, sorry, um, seen a bit. Uh, yeah.